A lot of people are wondering, who are these amazing guys hosting the Wilmington show? And in this segment, that's exactly what we're going to talk about. So introducing to you guys, I, I, you have to meet this guy. He is the godfather of media. He's the, the, the <laughs> transplant that's taking over. Look, you, need, you need to tone it down. You I, need to tone it down. Come on, Zach. The only thing I'm trying to do is get a job to host everywhere you go. Just like everywhere you go, I'm just bringing you on stage. So with that being said, I want to introduce you to Zach Phillips. Zach, what's going on, brother? How are you? I'm well, man. Who the heck is Zach, man? Like, I know you as Mr. Media, right? Mr. Media? Mr. Media. Okay. Like, you got this awesome company, man, Short Order Productions. Um, you're doing some amazing stuff, man. But who's Zach? Okay. Uh, so, uh, I'm Zach Phillips. I uh, was a filmmaker. I am a filmmaker. Mm -hmm. But I've been working in commercial film production for right. most of my career, and especially since I've been in Wilmington. Mm -hmm. So I moved to Wilmington in 2010. Right. Came here because uh, my wife uh, was a lawyer. And there's a lot of lawyers here. I don't know if you oh, knew that. Oh, there's a lot of lawyers here, but uh, she came here for that. Mm -hmm. And I started my company out of the coin loft when it was at 9th and Tattnall. Yeah. The OG co coin loft, although they would say... <laughs> There's actually a more OG coin loft than I was, <laughs> right. um, but it was it was the early days of co-working in America, yeah. and uh, Wilmington was early to that. Yeah. And then from there, um, moved into a space on Market Street. Mm -hmm. From there, moved into the train station where we were for four years, right. and now we've taken over the old W H Y Y Studios at Seventh and Orange, and uh, we have. 11 people here mm -hmm. and we we make commercials and web videos and um, nonprofit fundraising videos and all that type of stuff. Nice. So as a transplant, how do you like what 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 do you like about um, Wilmington? The thing about Wilmington is like everywhere I look in Wilmington I'm like what? Like this right. is right here and right. and and often the follow up is like and no one's using it? <laughs> right, like right, like, right, right, like so right. so this exists right here right. and it's like nobody's in there. Sort of like my train station office. Yeah, yeah. Is like this is the coolest office I have ever seen. Yeah. And nobody's in here. It was an amazing office. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it, it totally was, and it still is. We, there's some other folks in there now. Right. Um, Jet Phoenix Films, another yeah. film production company, has moved in there. Yeah. Shout out to Jet Phoenix. Yeah. Gotta love Jet. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, um, but yeah, like Wilmington is just opportunity, yeah. you know. And I know that, you know, that's been my experience. It's right. like everywhere I look, it's like. Wow, this is a really welcoming, yeah. opening, open community with lots of opportunity right. if you're if you're looking for it. And that's the great thing about what we're doing now, the Wilmington Show. You got two OGs hooking up, about them just making awesome content and bringing people, showing people the beautiful the beautiful parts of Wilmington, and also giving them a hub for information. So we're we're, we're going to talk about everything. I mean, in some senses, we're working across purposes here because. You know, I think one of the reasons that so much opportunity, it seemed like so much opportunity was here when I got here, right. was because people don't know about all this stuff. Right. And now we're gonna, we're, we're going to expose people to all of this cool stuff going on in Wilmington. Yeah. And so it'll get a little more, it'll be harder to find those things because those good things, you know, people are gonna snap them up. Yeah. That's the yeah. idea. And, and that's what we're seeing happening anyway. Yeah. So. And in Wilmington, there's just so many different gems, you know. Give me a couple that you like. Well, because I know you like the, I know you like Kid Chalene's. I, 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 well, I, see, here's the thing. So Kid Chalene's, I, I, I do like Kid Chalene's, mm -hmm. but particularly the buffalo wings at Kid Chalene's. <laughs> Those are some of the best buffalo wings in terms of, and I'm from Syracuse, New York. Right, right. Okay, which is close to Buffalo. Right. Okay, so I have credibility right. when it comes to talking about chicken wings. And Kid Chalene's are 90% of the time right. very legit, very, you know, as long as I think... There's been a couple times where it was inconsistent, mm -hmm. and that really threw me off. Right, right. But most of the time, those those wings are yeah. fantastic. We got that. Eight out of ten is not bad. Yeah. yeah. All right. But then also just the architecture. I mean, yeah. the 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 old buildings that like the fact that everything's so compact in yeah. this nice space. Yeah. Wilmington is just nothing but upside. As it's far beautiful. As I can tell. Yeah, it's yeah. amazing. Yeah. And, and we're great killer with the Wilmington show. That's right. That's right. Is it? That's what's happening. That's right. So I'm super excited to work with Zach here on the Wilmington Show. Make sure you follow us and Zach, give him the give him the website, Zach. Okay, the web the website is Wilmington dot show. Wilmington dot show. Is that is that cool? Is that like that? That's correct. Yeah. Okay. 
Yeah, right. that's what right. I'm saying. It's the Women's Show. Make it sure might you not be up by the time you see this clip, <laughs> right. but we're working on that. We're working on it. Everything's yeah. a work in progress. Yeah. Make sure you check us out the Women's Show. Yeah. Hey, guys. The YouTube algorithm requires that I tell you to like, comment, and subscribe. But I also wanted to tell you that if you have a Wilmington story that you want featured on the show, please submit it at stories.wilmington.love. We love to hear from you.